hello guys uh, today I'm going to show you how to automate a change of wallpapers after every fixed interval of time using an automation app uh, which is uh, known as tasker so everyone knows about tasker I think uh, I'll just show you the interface this is the interface of uh, the main page of tasker I'll just delete this task okay so I'll show you how to automate the changing of wallpapers after every fixed interval of time, uh, which is customizable. So let me start uh, with the very first thing. So this is ES Explorer, uh, and the very first thing that you need to do is to rename all the wallpapers in a very specific way. With that is, I will, uh, so these are my wallpapers. I want them want you to rename them uh, uh, like numbers uh, so starting from 1 and going up to n where n is a number of wallpapers so ES Explorer has a capability to do a batch rename which I'll show you so I'll select all the wallpapers I press the rename button I input one here start with 100 and press ok so what it will do is uh, it will rename all the wallpapers starting from 1100 and all the way up to uh, 1225 mm -hmm. okay so now I'll start tasker so I'll start with the uh, creation of a random variable uh, which will serve as the name of the wallpapers so I'll just uh, press the add button then I'll go to state start variables set variable value just uh, give a name to it i'll use random i'll give a value to it 1100 which was the um, which was the starting value uh, 1101 it was 1100 okay it was 1100 mm, 1100 the starting value of our uh, wallpapers i'll assign a new task i'll say call it wall change press ok ok so I'll add actions to that task press ok so the first action that I need to change is um, I want to create a variable and assign it a random value ok so I'll say uh, variables and I'll say randomize variable so I want to give the name I'll select uh, the variable that I have already defined there I'll choose it. I'll give a minimum value which was 1100 and the maximum value which was 11 to 5. And then I go back and I can add an action. Now, this time I want to change the wallpaper. So I'll search for wallpaper. Okay, so choose this one. So it will ask for an image. So just press the search button, choose any of the wallpapers uh, from the same folder uh, in which you have just renamed so if you select that folder you will see a name of the wallpaper so what you have to do is keep the extension and instead of this numbered name just type the name of the variable that we created random.jpg so now what will happen is this will generate a random variable uh, starting from 1100 and going all up to 11 to 6 and uh, it will set it as a wallpaper uh, you can use the setting scalar crop if you want otherwise it's not uh, necessary okay mm, nothing more to do here just press back so now what you want is you want to add a wait time so we will add a wait time where is it and we'll filter it wait Hmm. so you have a wait here so you can choose any time which you want uh, for wait uh, for just a for demo I'll set it as um, okay 7 seconds I'll go back and next what you want is to again go to step 1 and generate a new variable so I'll click here I'll say go to action if you can find here okay go go to and action number I'll say action number one okay so all done here 
we have our task ready now what i want is to create a profile uh, for which uh, this event will take place so i'll say time i want this change of wallpaper starting from current time to say 2:54 am and this is completely customizable you can set your own time or any event now i'll associate uh, the uh, task which i created with this event so i'll select this and okay so it is on i'll go to the home page and let me check if it works and wait for seven seconds okay wait a minute the task is not active i'll make it active so you just long press there and it will get enabled so let us see if it is working now see so wait for seven seconds one see it is changing after every seven seconds and for the sake of battery oh sorry for the sake of battery i would not want to set uh, change time of seven seconds i generally keep it as keep it as Two hours, which is sufficient. Okay, go here, back, I disable. Oh, sorry. I disable it. Okay, and I enable it again. So that was all uh, for Tasker. Uh, I'll come up with um, some more tutorials for Tasker uh, for now.